and welcome to our 15 Sec Tech Weekend YouTube episode. We've just wrapped up our summer break and we're super excited to be back with you guys. This week I have an Instagram spotlight and Laura has an app that lets you pre-check in to locations and events. And we're relaunching our 15 Sec website, so it's gonna be a lot easier for you guys to look at our back catalog, see our show notes and links and all that. So check it out at 15sectech.com. And don't forget to subscribe to the show right here on YouTube. Thanks for your support and we'll see you soon. The Be There app for Android and iOS is rethinking the social aspect of location-based check-ins by encouraging users to pre-check in by letting fellow app users and their Facebook friends know about their plans ahead of time. Once you post a Be There status, you can also turn the time and location into a funky animated GIF and post it via Facebook Messenger for friends you think should meet up with you later. Once you arrive at your destination, the app will prompt you to take a photo and other app users can then like or comment on your update. I've tried out a couple of wallet type cases for my iPhone and I really love being able to leave the house without having to grab anything more than just my phone. Well, Wally has a solution that lets you get this functionality with any smartphone case. Wally stick on wallet skins stick to most phone cases. They peel this off on the back and it'll stick to the case or even directly to the phone if you want. They are removable and they provide a pocket with a pull tab ribbon so that you can easily store and access your ID, credit and other cards. These are available in Ninja Black and Corduroy Brown and retail for between $20 and $40. Star Wars just launched its official app, which is available for iOS and Android devices. Everybody loves Star Wars, so I recommend that you give it a try. I will say that there's a long sign-up process, but after you do sign up, there are lots of great features within the app. One of the things that I really liked is the ability to take a selfie so you're a Star Wars character. There are also some really stellar sound effects. Match.com has announced the planned purchase of Vancouver-based online dating service Plenty of Fish for $575 million. Match.com launched in 1995 and its parent company also owns OkCupid and Tinder. Plenty of Fish meanwhile launched in 2003 and reports more than 90 million registered users with over 3 million active daily users. About 80% of Plenty of Fish users access the service on their mobile devices. For our Instagram Spotlight this week, we're recommending a site called Girls with Gluten. This is an Instagram account that's getting a ton of attention online. It features girls and women who are eating gluten-rich food like pasta and pastries. If you're on a carb-free diet, definitely don't subscribe.